You see, this is what happens when we all split up. Somebody dies or gets hurt. Don't yell at me, Cragger. This wasn't my fault. Well, Eris, it was your idea we should split up and find food. Oh, so you're saying you wanted us to starve? No, I wanted you to starve. Well, I'm the smartest one in the group. Oh, so you're a smartass. You know what, Cracker? I've had it with you. You're nothing but mean, evil, and cruel. All you care about is yourself. Well, guess what, bird? Will you both shut up? Look, I know you're upset here, but we're in the middle of a war. And also, if we want to help stop this war, we need to put our heads together and get along so we can help stop it. Clear? I don't like babysitting 15-year-olds. Also, we probably lost a lot of people. Just imagine Chima ruined when they tried to fight for it. And they put an effort into it. But all we cared about is arguing about if we were going to starve or not. When right here, our hero, Drake, just died for us. That's so brave of him to do. He went out of his way and saved us. Well, me. So let's put our heads together and think about how to stop this war. <sighs> I hate her yelling at us. But Lauren's right. We shouldn't fight at all. We need to be a team and work together. Very inspirational, my friend, but what do we do about Laval? What do you mean, what do we do about Laval? I mean, Laval is charging towards us with a black sword. Man, Razor, way to be racist. Cragger, I'm serious. Wait, Drake, you're alive? Uh, yeah, I've been alive for, like, 30 minutes. <laughs> Ever since he shot me. I guess I have fireproof scales. Fireproof scales? But that's a power. Maybe you're somehow related to Dimension. Yeah, I guess. But you should chain up Laval. He's important to the darkest summoning thing. I'll tell you guys about it. I wish I would have told you guys this sooner. But I didn't think Darkest would have been summoned. So, in order for Darkest to destroy a tribe, they must sacrifice the hair of that tribe in order for Darkest to kill the others. But Darkest doesn't just stop there. After he destroys one tribe, he'll go on to the next one and the next one. So it's not war. It's not just war, is it? It's extinction. He's going to kill us all. Yeah. Everyone except for us, the dragons. So, my friend, let me get this straight. Laval's gonna be the one that dies first? Yeah, pretty much. Why? Yes! Finally! <sighs> um, I mean, <clears throat> poor guy. And do you think you can stop them with very little chi and armor? <sighs> you wouldn't even have a chance. Huh? Crueler, why would you help us? You hate us. Drake, we shouldn't trust her. I'm sorry, Cracker, but I will trust her. Alright, what kind of game are you playing? No game. None. I just brought harnesses for Cragger and Lauren and she for you. Guys. And, and also a potion to help with Laval's mind control. Thank you, Crueler, but I don't plug Chi. Well, everyone does plug Chi and you- Crueler's right, Lauren. You need to learn how to plug Chi. And plus, it doesn't hurt. The only thing that happens to you that you get high. That's pretty much it. She's just a drug.
Okay, let's go. We need to plug some chi, get the antidote to Laval. Quick, Darkus is coming. How can you tell? Instinct. Oh, uh, of course. Duh. Well, that was easy. Yep. <laughs> hey, guys. Oh, my God. Uh, is it normal for a spear to go, like, right through your stomach? No? Huh. That explains why I'm so dizzy. Drake, what was that? <sighs> Darkus must have defeated the Legend Beast. He didn't kill it, but he wounded it really badly. And now he wants a sacrifice. So, you girls stay here and guard Laval, because once Dimension calls Laval for the sacrifice, well, Laval's instincts will kick in, and he will walk to right towards the mouth of Darkus, and Darkus will swallow him whole, and he will go down his esophagus, and then the world is screwed. But on the bright side, I have the dragon sword, so I can control Darkus and tell him to stop. So you're telling me I have to wait for my sacrifice, even though I saved you from that legend beast? You shall be punished. Oh, punishment. Oh, Darkus, as my punishment, I will give up my kingly hood to my daughter, Danielle. That's not exactly what I had in mind. You shall learn. Discipline. No, stop, Darkus. Don't kill them. They're innocent. Kill me instead. Hmm. You have a kind heart, Drake. Like a king would. M me? Be the king? But I did all those awful things. I killed people. Just because we're mean to people doesn't mean we are. We don't have a second chance. It is time for us to leave. I must take all the Dragon Tribe members somewhere safe. Fire-breathing beasts should not be mixed with animals. I'm sorry. This is goodbye. Drake, you could take your girlfriend if it's okay with her mother. Oh yes, and Cragger. That crocodile legend beast is linked to the Outlands. Heroes, good luck in the Outlands. Oh, <laughs>